This is our portable traffic light, one of our products produced by PT Lights Inc. Here is some usage for our unit and they are just a lot more. Here are some of the few benefits that can be had from using our unit. Here are some of the parts being used in this unit and there are more in it. Here are some of the features that this unit has and there are a lot more that can be included. Here is the assembly of the unit itself. Here the quad pod is taken out of the trunk of the car and laid on the ground. The knob on the leg which has the pull ring is slackened and the lead is extended out to its full length then the knob is tightened. The knob on the three other legs are slackened and the legs are pulled out but do not pull them out fully as yet. Then the quad pod is raised up vertically and as straight as possible and the legs will come down. Tighten each of the knobs on the three legs and that should hold the leg in place. Move it into position and pull the two opposing legs apart. Lift up two legs off the ground and push the spreaders down to the full extent. This holds the legs in the exact position to the greatest stability. Place the quad pod with the two bars on the bottom of the center pole facing you. Take out the control box and hitch it onto these two bars and that adds the stability to the quad pod. Take out the traffic director and place it on top of the quad pod. The two red bars should align. Tighten the knob on the light bar. Then uncoil the wire at, on the control box and plug it into the light bar. Similarly, the two red indications should light up and then the plug is inserted into the socket and tightened. The on-off off switch is switched on and the cover of the control box is opened and the selection of the light pattern is made. Then hold on to the knob and slacken it on the top of the quad pod and it will raise up the light bar. Tighten the knob now and that should be it. Hold the two legs which do not have the rollers on it and using the rollers roll it to the position that you would like it to be in. Open the control box and there you can choose different patterns of light sequence and there are other knobs which for other uses. This completes the assembly of the unit. Please visit our website and see our other products and you can contact me Douglas Chin at dogchin at rogers.com for more answers to your questions.